Okay, this video is for all the astronomy buffs out there. And basically I'm going to show you how you can make a solar filter, just like this, for your refracting telescope or your reflecting telescope. I happen to have a 90 millimeter Mead DS2000 series telescope. It's a refractor. And I wanted to be able to view the sun, the solar activity and sunspots. And that's why I made this to go with my telescope. I took a piece of solar film. I got this from an astronomy store online. Some people use this regular mylar. I mean, that probably works fine too, but this is a special film, and it was very inexpensive. So I bought a sheet of it. I think it came about one foot square. And I measured the inside diameter of the end of the telescope where the objective lens is. And I found that this PVC cap, which is a four inch flat cap, fits almost perfectly inside the end of the telescope. So what I did to make it fit snug, I just put this band of this black uh, heavy duty tape. It's very thin, doesn't peel off, and that just takes up a little bit of the play. So when you slide it inside the objective lens end, it'll grab tight and it won't wobble around or fall out. And I only push this maybe an inch and a half in. I leave about a quarter of an inch sticking out. So when it's all finished, I can just grab it and slide it back out. Now, for this type of a telescope, or even Celestron and others, just measure the inside diameter or the outside diameter. And then once you have that dimension, you can find out what kind of a flat PVC cap you're going to need to get the job done. And in my case, a four inch cap was fine. Drill as large of a hole as possible. I only had about a two and three quarter inch or two and a half inch hole saw laying around. And for the purpose of viewing the sun because it's so bright, it doesn't make a difference in blocking a little bit of a uh, lens out. So there's still plenty of light entering. Once you have the hole cut, then what you're going to do is you're going to cut the, you're going to trace out the solar filter so it fits perfectly inside the cap. Once it fits perfectly inside the cap, you're going to remove it. Then you're going to put a thin film of clear silicone adhesive around the whole inside rim. And then you're going to gently push down the filter. You don't want to put a lot, just a, uh, a thin layer that will glue it. Just a thin layer that will allow the film to adhere to the PVC cap. Go all the way around, and when you're done, just get a thin bead of the silicone and smooth it out along the whole inside rim. And this will be in there very tight. It's like a drum, and it will not come out. And it's as simple as that, and it works really, really good. And I will show you right now what it looks like looking at the sun through this particular lens that I made. 